Good morning, Niski Unit. Today is Friday, September 27th. I'm Anthony. And I'm Eric. Here's what's making news. Freshman elections are October 11th. If you'd like to run for office, the petition process begins this Monday, September 30th. Go to the Foreign Language Office to get information about running. In sports, the football team plays tonight at 7 p.m. at Schenectady. The game is on Time Warner Cable Channel 3, so make sure you tune in. The golf team lost to Bethlehem on Wednesday. Mike Chow thought a shot of 38. The boys' varsity soccer team tied Chen this week 1-1 after two overtimes. The boys played at Burnt Hills yesterday and lost 1-0. The boys play at home at 11 a.m. tomorrow. The girls' varsity soccer team lost to Chen 2-1 on Tuesday and was home yesterday against Burnt Hills. The boys' varsity cross-country team placed second last weekend at the Queensbury Invitational. The runners travel to Utica this weekend. Runners, let's set some new personal records. Our girls' tennis team lost to Shen this week 7-2. Annie Phillips and Sarah Connolly each won their singles match. The crew team has its first regatta of the season at the, fi at the tail of the fish in Saratoga tomorrow. Good luck, rowers. The varsity field hockey team beat Shen on Wednesday by a score of 1-0. The Lady Warriors record is now 6-1. and one. Way to go, girls. In other news, upperclassmen, you may want to remember that last year, Mr. DeCesar's TV studio production and broadcast class aired live announcements on BD days as the semester ran on. One of the cool pieces the class did was five questions. Well, Mr. DeCesar has another TV class this semester and this week. The TV class tried its first five questions segment. Roll the clip, Alex. Hi, welcome to the five questions show. I'm Jad Jacobs. Here's the first question. Would you rather burn to death or freeze to death? I would probably rather burn to death because I can't stand the cold. Um, second question. If there was a US evacuation, would you rather go to Canada or Mexico? I would probably go to Canada since I've been there multiple times and it's closer. So if something happens on a flight to Mexico, which is less likely since it's less likely since it's closer to Canada. Um, third question. Would you rather have an iPhone or an Android and why? I would probably have an iPhone because I already have an iPhone. Question four, which country would you like to visit and why? I would probably want to visit Egypt because I've always wanted to see the Great Pyramids and Egyptian culture has always fascinated me. Question five, if I had to be a one Star Wars character, who would I be and why? I would probably be Count Dooku because when I was younger and watched all the movies, he was my favorite character. And that's all the questions we have for now. I'm Jad Jacob and this is the Five Questions Show. Thanks. Now you've seen this year's version of five questions, but we need your help. The segment doesn't work without interesting questions. We are asking you to submit questions you'd like to see answered on the show. Please submit your written questions to Mr. O'Connor in the TV studio. Hey, fellow seniors. I'm one of those. Our big photo for the yearbook, the giant group shot where we spell out 2014, will be October 11th. We'll continue to remind you. Next up is the weekend forecast with my brother Mike. I'm Mike Flash, your weatherman, appearing to you from high above gorgeous Acapulco, Mexico. And here's your forecast for this weekend for Niskuna. Tonight will be clear with a low around 50 degrees. Saturday will have a high of 73 degrees and be mostly sunny. Saturday night will be a repeat of tonight and Sunday will also be sunny and 73 degrees. It's going to be a great weekend out there, so go out there and enjoy it. And finally, here's today's lunch menu. Today's menu for lunch. Baked ziti, garlic roll, green beans, and, and for dessert, cake with strawberries. Bon appetit. That's all the news we have today. Have a great weekend.